Hello everyone. So today in this video, we will be going to take a look on Agent Designer, which is coming in Vertex AI. So Agent uh, Designer has actually been in the market of uh, uh, designing your agentic AI, uh, like kind of any agents uh, with the help of AI. And uh, those agents will not require now the code. So it's totally the uh, no code and low code platforms. Uh, through which you can design your uh, agents and this actually came from vertex ai google cloud so in this video today we will be going to take a look on a complete uh, like agent uh, designer platform how we can design the agents and how we can uh, get the code and uh, do modify and transition more in google agent development kit so google agent development kit is a main uh, backbone uh, for the agentic AI development uh, under the hood of Google Cloud. So now that requires your coding skills and uh, design, uh, like developing your agents through code, either with TypeScript, uh, it's released very new and with the help of Python, uh, Google ADK. But now in this agent uh, AI, agent designer, under the Vertex AI, you don't need to write a code. You just need to plug and play and your platform is ready and then you can get your code and do the transitions more in google adk so let's uh, dive into it and we will be take a look on like what agent designer is so this is a documentation url of uh, google cloud agent builder slash agent designer so this is actually for setting up your environment and it's in the google cloud and uh, like you need to do the uh, define your agents and sub agents i will uh, go through it uh, detail step by step and uh, you need some uh, im access roles for uh, doing those for accessing the mcp server inside it so that's uh, kind of a, a little of a guide uh, for the google cloud agent designer in vertex ai and by the way uh, this is actually the google cloud slash vertex ai slash agent and slash agent designer this is actually the link for doing this once you will go into google cloud you can find under agent builder here so in agent builder you can see here agent designer so when you click on it you will land on this screen and you will have to kick start your agent ai development with the help of designing no code so i also have a complete uh, uh, step by step article which i wrote uh, just now and i will uh, publish it to the publication called generative ai i'm the proud author of generative ai publication so this will be published and it's a whole step by step journey if you want to go through like how you need to do work with uh, like vertex ai agent designer this is a very cool thing guys so uh, like how we can do it like uh, for this actually uh, sometimes uh, like I must recommend you to go and uh, give all the permissions I think it will give you the permissions error like this project is not uh, having with the uh, like services if I can go into the agent designer here so I can show you so in the agent designer uh, okay so that actually requires permissions for you so you need to do the like uh, enable the apis obviously so here you need to click on this create agent and uh, inside this agent uh, you can see here if i can zoom it a bit so you can see here agent so my agent right so here this is actually the main agent and you can name it whatever you want so, like i can give it to like a job search agent and uh, the data which i can like help, help interact with uh, agent to help me uh, finding uh, specific job opportunities uh, related to my skills and experience so this is what you need to do and i have uh, this chat gpt where i uh, i need to find out so this is actually uh, the skills and all i need to paste it here uh, where it went here so instruction now you need to when you, once you click on your agent you need to provide your details name description what this uh, agent will do and step by step instructions here so i'm pasting out for now this uh, uh, a paragraphic way but it should have to be in a more detailed and instructive way so that you need to make sure 
okay so that's not sufficient but for now in the testing phase like uh, you need to do like this and here you have multiple options like whatever you want to select for your uh, gemini model like i can select gemini 3 pro for preview and also we have a cool uh, tools to uh, get use of it so however in agent development kit what we need to do is like we need to create a tools directory and inside those tools we will be going to like uh, not tools directory but uh, those are actually kind of tools to uh, access your google drive to go on your linkedin or some kind of like those tools which you can take help of so here you just need to uh, like uh, rather than doing development since agent ai agentic ai designer is a low code platform so you just need to like uh, google search is automatically been uh, upcoming here if you guys can if i can show you so i think uh, something yeah so here in the tools actually you can see there's a google search url context but if you click on that plus icon so you can see there are multiple other uh, as well so if you want to add mcp so you need to provide display name endpoint url and authentication which you need to provide and that will be using your mcp as well so there are a bunch of tools which you can take help of and also you can add uh, vertex ai data store as well for this one so is if you have any data store which is available inside uh, google so you can uh, like obviously uh, make use of it and apart from that uh, yep okay so these are actually being uh, the use of tools however like for at the moment i only need uh, those two so i'm not selecting anything so once you will be out of this so your agent is ready right now if you want to create sub agent uh, with your agent so if i can click on this plus icon so obviously sub agent will be going to create right so now like whatever you want to do here like in my case i've actually selected a sub agent for uh making my uh, like uh, life easier and that is for uh, like uh, for doing the uh for modifying the cover letter so if i can show you here so if, if we can go into the vertex ai here we can pass uh, this sub agent is to modify my cover later right so agent uh, now you need to provide the description what this will be going to do but this is optional so agent that handles a specific task to modify my cover letter as per job opportunities right so spelling mistake my bad okay so now here i have this uh, actually a little of uh, more instructive way to provide uh, to my sub agent so this is my sub agent and responsible if we, if you guys can see you are an ai agent responsible for customizing and optimizing my cover letter for each job opening so this is what actually I'm doing uh, with this sub agent. So here also I'm uh, selecting Gemini 3 Pro. And uh, like if you guys can have it, so you can provide your Vertex AI search data store and etc. But I have selected these two tools at the moment, uh, Google search and URL context. So at the moment it's been perfectly done. So this is actually is it and now your job agent is done so we have flow tab and we have also the preview tab as well so if you like once your agent is done and you can also age uh, like add more sub agents as well to uh, like uh, help you uh, what i can say you to help you to achieve this uh, task in a more better way but at the moment uh, i don't need it and i want to test this agent uh, in the preview mode so in this preview now i'm uh, like because my agent is ready now i want my agent to test if it's working perfectly so here i want to ask uh, please find some opportunities as per my skills along with the so you now agent is been working and uh, you will you will look like which agent 
tool is being going to consume so this is consuming google search agent so throughout the google it will be searching for job opportunities related to my skills and experiences okay so now after creating uh, so after creating this uh, agent actually we can go and uh, we can preview that by asking something in detail and it will go uh, give you through the results and apart from that actually in the gate code so once your instructions and once your agent are ready so you can get the code so here you can see uh, you can replace it with your agent dot py with the code by uh, like with the agent development kit so this is very cool uh, tool guys so like earlier than this tool actually we need to go and set up the whole agent uh, agent development kit uh, like behind the scenes obviously that's very simple to do if you are doing it with python or typescript but now this is actually very simple so it's kind of a no code and low code platform to set up your agi uh, like ai agents under the hood of vertex ai google cloud so it's been a super thing and go start and check it out so i will also place my uh, article link which i just uh, showed to you so the article which i have written this one is step by step so you guys can have a look and uh, check it out vertex ai agent uh, ai designer so see you guys for the next video thank you so much